we don't expect that the whole country will return to their desks as one from Monday. The key thing is the government is, is no longer telling people that it's necessary uh, that they should work from home uh, and uh, the rest is really for, uh, for employees, employers to, uh, to, to work out for, uh, for themselves. Good afternoon. On a, on a crowded uh, tube train, we would, uh, as a government, expect and recommend uh, that people wear masks, and I've no doubt that that is what, uh, what people will do. Will I personally wear a mask? I think that, uh, as I said earlier on, it will depend on the, uh, on the circumstances. What we want to do is uh, for people to exercise their personal responsibility, but to remember the value of, of face coverings, both in protecting themselves and, and others. We're setting out guidance for business for a gradual return to work over the summer. The key thing is the government is, is no longer telling people that it's necessary uh, that they should work from home uh, and uh, the rest is really for, uh, for employees, employers to, uh, to, to work out for, uh, for themselves. There, there isn't a, a, an optimal time, um, but I think that the reality is that both uh, deaths and hospitalizations uh, are sadly going to, to rise whenever uh, you go for an, an unlocking of the kind that we are. And uh, we, we simply must, uh, we, as, as Chris puts it, there will be an exit wave, and we simply have to, to recognize that. We're seeing more hospitalizations. Uh, we're seeing uh, c continued deaths, although the numbers are, are very, very greatly reduced. As the days have gone by, it has grown ever clearer that these vaccines are indeed successful, with the majority of those admitted to hospital unvaccinated. As a matter of social responsibility, we're urging nightclubs and other venues with large crowds to make use of the NHS COVID pass which shows proof of vaccination, vaccination, a recent negative test, or natural immunity as a means of entry. People may want to keep maintaining social distancing, they may want to keep being sensible, uh, but as far as I can see, uh, we will be in a much better position as a country uh, to go forward with the full uh, opening ups that we uh, we envisage. There are many businesses that need to uh, move beyond social distancing, um, many jobs uh, where we need to be able to, to do things uh, in the way that we always used to, to do them and people are, are yearning to get back to that uh, as indeed uh, as I am and so I'm determined uh, to be able to do that uh, by July the, the 19th. From step four we will remove all legal limits on the numbers meeting indoors and outdoors. We will allow all businesses to reopen, including nightclubs. We will lift the limit on named visitors to care homes and on numbers of people attending concerts, theatre and sports events.